here, drop that there, here's your bargain, 45, got to remember the 45 is up here at the same time you're turning, there's the bargain drop, one arm and drop, so we preset that, keep it in place and uh, move around and then swing, and the trick is which I forgot to mention the last time. We call it the gate lock or the VLS, which is the Varden lock swing. Because you're in here and you're looking at the target and you're putting it in to the slot and then you're swinging it around. So it gets you in a very good position, but here's key. You need to be relaxed. Light pressure, don't overpower it. And just let it swing. Even grip pressure, but light grip pressure. Now, you'll see on my feet, I've got a pair of running shoes. Very useful because you're Weight should be in between the there and there. Unless you're Scotty Schiffler who has all his weight on his toes, but he's one of the few players that does that. So check it here with a line, but you can have it from your toe out, run it, bang it. Now from here, light grip pressure. This little move that you see me sometimes do really helps. Check the pressure. And the easier you swing it, the sweeter the feel will be of the face. And uh, the ball will go just the same distance. And Your body is reacting to, and I'll show you, so you're in, your body's just moving to you moving the club. Rather than the other way around. So when you do it that way, <clears throat> you're actually getting your sequence right because the club's moving and your body's just reacting to it so it's a bit like and if I <laughs> right so it's the same thing when I showed that last week when you when you go and you can go all the way around right but if you if you just you won't get as far. You know, when pros and that, and all these uh, coaches, and, and the, the buzzword is every pro you hear Rory, use the ground more, use the ground more. And we don't all have access to force plates and things that tell you what you're doing. So if you work on the premise that your knees are flexed and when when you're moving you, your knees have to remain flexed um, if you are like standing up before you've hit the ball, then you're coming out the shot. Whereas 
you'll see the real big hitters really sink, but they'll be <clears throat> pushing up. It kind of accelerates everything. It's back to that idea where if I just pull on the club, whoa! All I did there was I'm just swinging the club, and all I'm going to do is just go. Whoa! It's just so that's all you're doing. It's a it's a reverse move to give extra speed to the club. Again, you cannot do it if you've got too much tension in your hands. Your grip's got to be good. But the easiest way to work out if you've got the right tension is if you can do this in freely. Because if you are gripping it too tight, oh my god, oh my god, oh boy, I can't, I can't do it. But if I get the right grip pressure, I can, I can do it. Yeah, but if I tense up, uh, uh, there is no way I'm doing that move. So that's the best way to get the right uh, grip uh, and pressure. And this is the best way every shot to make sure your shoulders are in the right position and make sure you're the same distance away from the ball. And you, you will be amazed at just how little effort you use to hit the ball. Yeah. It keeps it going, you know, as far, you know. So, thanks for watching. The Varden Swing Lock, or the Gate Lock. Well, the reason it's called a Gate Lock is, for obvious reasons, is the Varden triangle lines here and you're setting up and then you're swinging your hands around but you're keeping this locked. Then from there you can hit any shot you want. Yeah. The reason uh, he kind of used it a lot and it came kind of lost and stuff, well, Mo Norman touched on it umpteen times. Mo Norman said that 90% of the golf swings knackered in the first foot. So Mo Norman took that out and just swung from there. So the, the, the Varden lock or the gate lock or whatever you want to call it with the Varden triangle line is doing the same thing. It's, it's getting you to aim at the point there, make sure you're Set, swing around whatever locked. And uh, yeah, a bit more explanation on the gate lock swing from Harry Varden. Thanks for watching and subscribing and hitting the like button. Brilliant stuff. Uh, we're trying to get all the ad revenue to charity, so Macmillan, help the heroes, Shelby UK. As and when, see you all soon.